Hi. My name is Anina and I'm the CEO of 360 Fashion Network. I'm here today to bring you the latest fashion tech news that you need to know. Before we start, if you want to receive this news roundup regularly, then hit that like button and smash that follow as we will be bringing you this new every week to keep you in the know of the top stories we think are important. Alright, first up, Roblox World Maker Splash just raised over $20 million to create virtual pop stars and Avon social gaming experiences. They currently have three official virtual beings live, one of which is named Kai. She has music out on Spotify and other platforms. No, Splash is the 150th most popular map in Roblox, having been played 125 million more times. In the game, Splash players can arrange song packs to compose full tracks, then pay to perform their tracks in unique ways for fans. News source, Virtual Humans, Amazon is on track to become the U.S. largest delivery service by the end of this year or early 2022. The retail giant's CEO of Worldwide Consumer made the statement during an interview with CNBC on Monday. Amazon has an enormous network of planes, ships, vans, and trucks to deliver consumer orders across the country. This may make brands reconsider selling on Amazon if the supply chain and transportation bottleneck keeps growing. News source, CNBC, ENV Tech's group, the parent company of Zara, announced the company's founder's daughter, Marta Ortega, will become the company's new chair starting April 1. Ortega has worked for Spain-based ENV Tech's group for 15 years overseeing the Zara brand. As part of the transition, the group's current general counsel and board secretary, Oscar Garcia Macarez, will assume the role of chief executive of the company. ENV Tech's group, the world's largest fast fashion group, was founded in 1985 by Amancio Ortega and his wife, Rosalia Mera. It operates over 7,000 stores in 93 markets around the world. In a statement, Ortega noted she has always wanted to dedicate her life to building on her parents' legacy. Following the announcement, shares of ENV Tech's fell 6%. It closed at $15.81. News source, Financial Times. President Biden hosted the CEOs of several retailers at the White House on Monday to discuss efforts to address rising prices and supply chain issues. Among those who attended were Samsung CEO K. S. Choi, Kroger CEO Rodney McMullen, Etsy CEO Josh Silverman, Best Buy CEO Corey Berry, and Walmart CEO Doug McMillan. Biden wanted to know the challenges the companies were facing and how the government might be of assistance going into the heavy holiday shopping period. Earlier this month, the Biden administration announced a $4 billion plan to rebuild U.S. coastal ports and inland waterways to help with cargo ship backlogs. News source, CNBC, Instagram head Adam Masseri is scheduled to testify about the platform's potentially harmful impacts on young users at a Senate subcommittee hearing on December 6. The news comes after Facebook whistleblower Francis Haugen testified and leaked internal documents showing that Instagram's engagement-based ranking can negatively impact the mental health of teens and young girls. Blumenthal wants Instagram to commit to making its algorithms transparent to expose how they might promote potentially harmful content. News source, The New York Times, and that's it for today. If you want to get the full top 10 fashion tech news items of the week, Check out our new podcast 360 Fashion or go to 360fashion.net slash podcast or search for it on your favorite podcast platform. Don't forget to subscribe so that you won't miss our latest episode.